I'm Jennifer Martin, principal here at Goshen High School. From what I can tell, no one else is around, so I can take this off. I look so much better with a mask off, right? Right? You know there's only one answer to that question. Anyone? Anyone? Before I get into how school is going to look this year, I have a very important message. The whole entire staff misses you. The hallways miss you. The chorus room misses you. The steam lab misses you. The brand new auditorium misses you. Heck, I even miss you. And it's my first year, I haven't gotten a chance to meet you all yet. We can't wait to see you again, and that'll happen soon. But in order for us to all be together again, which is what we all want, there are a few things we need to do. As a team, teamwork, teamwork, teamwork. Like the gladiators we are, and I have no doubt we can get through this as one team. So join me and a few friends as we show you some things to keep in mind throughout the school year. Let me just get changed into some first day of school clothes. That's better. I haven't seen Heather in what feels like forever. And as much as I wanna give her that hug, I have to maintain social distancing to keep everybody safe. This year, the only way to enter the school will be through the building's main entrance. As you can see, Heather looks a little confused. She's noticing something hanging on the wall she's never seen before. Sort of looks like that robot from, what's that Disney movie? Is it Short Circuit? No, that's from the 80s. My robot? Wally, that's it. The thing totally looks like Wally. The difference is, our Wally is there to take your temperature and make sure you're feeling well that day. He can check up to 16 of you at one time, and he'll let the health office know if there's anything for us to worry about. The only thing you have to do is move on to your classroom, and you're clearly going to be excited to get to class. I mean, who wouldn't be excited to see Mrs. Villegas? But as much as you're going to want to rush into that classroom, be patient, one at a time. Once you enter the classroom, go to your assigned desk only. As you can see, Henry's locker isn't working as it used to. That's because lockers are not a thing this year. Instead, keep your personal belongings on you and put them on the back of your chair in each class. And I know this is gonna be hard, but masks have to be worn at all times in the building. If you forgot yours or yours breaks, just let your teacher know and one will be provided for you. The only time we can really take them off is during lunch. Speaking of lunch, this year the cafeteria is rolling out delivery service. You won't even have to leave your six period class. Lunch will be served right there. Bathroom usage will look a little different too this year. After getting permission from your teacher, check to make sure the bathroom is unoccupied. You may have to wait your turn on the marker outside. Just remember, one at a time. Also, those water fountains may seem like they're broken this year, but they're not. You just need to use the bottle filler instead. Bring your own container. Dismissal this year will be staggered. You'll see what that means soon. Regardless, just wait for your turn to leave the classroom. And be mindful of the hallways. All of them are one direction. That's what makes you no, not that one direction. Just follow the arrows. You can handle that, right? Like the grocery store. You're going the wrong way! He says we're going the wrong way. How would he know where we're going? Many say this year will be full of challenges. But I know this year will be full of opportunities. We have a chance to come together and show grit true gladiator strength. Take one day at a time and know that we're here to support you. It's okay to be nervous and excited and confused all at the same time. Remember, the best part of this year will be seeing you on campus, even if it's with a mask. We can't wait to get back to this, and this, and this. And the better that we all work together, the sooner we can get there. We need your help so that we can get to that spot together. See you soon.